Welcome back to Leeds United Ultra. It's a bit of a bonus video today because there's been some breaking news. We've had to pay 18 million for Jean de Kevin Augustin, which is absolute. This could affect Leeds January uh, transfer window. Uh, obviously, he didn't play well, scored three goals for Leeds United and or play three games for Leeds United and didn't score a goal. He was probably one of Leeds United's worst signings. We paid um, 20 of million for him and uh, we've got to pay that 18 million back. I think is in instalments. So this is basically going to be uh, a quick video. Um, oh, that, that, that could like hamper at least one of the sign-ins um a left back um i think we've been linked to um a new left back at the moment who plays in italy i don't know like too much about him or the the, the details on that one at the moment but i i oh what would you prefer in january to sort of take out a left back i'm heading towards a left back more now than, than the striker, even though Pascal Strout can play left back. But then some days I'll go, oh, we need a striker. But is this 18 million pounds going to affect Leeds United um, in the January transfer window? Let me know what you think. And uh, as well, if you can hit that like button and uh, subscribe to the channel as um, I'm doing two to three videos um, a day and as well I'll be doing some live streams coming up uh, got the under 21s coming up next week and I'm trying to uh, live stream um, as they look to bounce back to winning ways after being knocked out the Papa John's trophy um, go and check that video out um, yeah losing to crew that was a freaking nightmare so hopefully we can beat Bournemouth tomorrow time of recording half past 12 so this will be out within like the next hour and um, as well we have like I said in my previous video um, go and check that out at the deep intake in Tyler Adams um, how I I personally think that he is at the moment especially for the price what was it 12 million pounds we pay for him he is equally as good as Con Kante for what we pay for him so yeah that's that um, I just think Kevin Agostan that is going to that, that that could affect in January or Leeds didn't pay on any players because they knew this was coming up um, and they made something like 11, 7 or 11 million pound profit um, in, and they only bought Ganoto in and that's why they didn't bring another striker because they knew potentially they was going to lose this. So that's um, like a quick update. Um, so yeah, he's uh, he's played. I think he's in Switzerland now. Um, he's played for other clubs that he hasn't like done that well. But this was like one of the worst things that potentially could have happened. Um, the appeal, there is an appeal in there, but I don't. They think it's minimal. Uh, that's come from like Phil Hay, so. That's pretty much bang on, you would say, wouldn't it? Uh, so that is a blow. I've just got a feeling it's gonna affect like the January transfer window, as I keep saying. And then there could be like quite a lot of these fans who's gonna be like, oh no, no transfers come January, but I, and it's gonna affect. Um, and it's been blowing the board and blah de blah blah but yeah it's just one of those things it was gonna happen um i didn't think it is worth over like going to appeal on this situation 
but yeah um, until next time which will be later on this afternoon about half four time um, we will have the Leeds Bournemouth preview um, until then if you can hit that subscribe button hit that like button and uh, so my video gets recommended by YouTube and gets out to the algorithm and all that and uh, until next time I'll see you later